Houston firefighters are at the co-cathedral of the Sacred Heart in downtown. Shelby Rose is live near the scene on St. Joseph's Parkway. What can you tell us, Shelby? Well, we did just get briefed by the district chief out here about 20 minutes ago, and firefighters have found the source of the fire inside the co-cathedral of the Sacred Heart. We're told that it started in the mechanical room. Possibly an elevator motor was the thing that caught fire, although that is not con confirmed. That is just preliminary information right now. We do have dozens of fire trucks out here, firefighters working right now. We do know that what they're doing at the moment is just making sure that the smoke is cleared and that the whole entire scene is contained. We're told there is moderate to heavy smoke damage on three floors of the building. We're told this is a more of like an office space in the back of the church. It was about before 5.30 when a smoke alarm went off. There were no, no one was inside the building at the time of the fire when one fire engine arrived to check it out. That's when they noticed smoke throughout those three floors. They immediately called back up and it took about an hour for them to find the source called for an extra alarm because we needed the manpower due to the size of this building and it's kind of unique so it's really just been a detective game this morning not a lot of damage due to the fire but there is some significant smoke on some of the floors now, Houston Fire arson investigators are here on scene, but that is just standard procedure with two alarm fires as well as it being a church. Now, if you are driving downtown, I will say only this block of Jefferson is completely blocked off to traffic. Both Fannin and San Jacinto are open, only one lane, though, so, but cars are able to get through. So if you are just driving downtown, be cautious of that while fire crews will be here for at least another couple hours. Reporting live in downtown Houston, Shelby Rose, Fox 26 News.